हेलो एवरी वन एंड वेलकम बैक टू अनदर एपिसोड ऑफ श्रीमद भगवद गीता रिटोल बाय भास्कर योगाचार्य इन द प्रीवियस एपिसोड वी लर्न अबाउट अक्षर ब्रह्म योग नाउ वी शेल बिगेन विद अध्याय नाइन्थ राज विद्या राजकुआम योग द नाइन्थ चैप्टर ऑफ भगवद गीता इज राज विद्या राज्य को हम योग इन दिस चैप्टर श्री कृष्ण एक्सप्लेन्स दैट ही सुप्रीम एंड हाउ दिस मटीरियल एग्जिस्टेंस इज क्रिएटेड मैनिफेस्टेड एंड डिस्ट्रॉयड बाई हिज योग माया एंड ऑल बींग्स कम एंड गो अंडर हिज सुपरविजन ही रिवील्स द रोल एंड द इम्पॉर्टेंस ऑफ भक्ति टूवर्ड्स आर स्पिरिचुअल अवेकनिंग इन दिस डिवोशन वन मस्ट लिव फॉर द गॉड ऑफर एवरीथिंग दैट ही पोजेस to him and do everything for him only one who follows such devotion becomes free from the bonds of this material world and unites with the lord the lord said i shall declare to you who does not cavil this most mysterious knowledge together with special knowledge knowing which you would be freed from evil this is a royal science royal mystery the supreme purifier it is realized by direct experience it is in accord with dharma it is pleasant to practice and is abiding man devoured of faith in this dharma o scorcher of foes ever remain without attaining me in the mortal pathway of sansara this entire universe is pervaded by me in an unmanifest form all beings abide in me but i do not abide in them and yet beings do not abide in me behold my divine yoga i am the upholder of all beings and yet i am not in them my will alone causes their existence as the powerful element air moving everywhere ever remains in the ether know that so to all beings abide in me all beings o arjun enter into my prakriti at the end of the cycle of time again i send these forth at the beginning of the cycle controlling the prakriti which is my own i send forth again and again all this multitude of beings helpless under the sway of prakriti but these actions do not bind me o arjun for i remain detached from them like one unconcerned under my supervision prakriti gives birth to all mobile and immobile entities because of this o arjun does the world revolve fools disregard me dwelling in the human form not knowing my higher nature as a supreme lord of all beings senseless man entertain a nature which is deluding and akin to that of rakshas and asur their hopes are vain acts as vain and knowledge is vain but the great souled ones o arjun who are associated with my divine nature worship me with unwavering mind knowing me to be the immutable source of beings aspiring for eternal communion with me they worship me always singing my praises striving with steadfast resolution and bowing down to me in devotion others to besides offering the sacrifice of knowledge worship me as one 
who characterized by diversity in numberless ways is multiformed in my cosmic aspect i am the kratu i am the sacrifice i am the offerings to the mains i am the herb i am the mantra i am myself the clarified butter i am the fire i am the oblation i am the father mother creator and grandfather of the universe i am the purifier i am the syllable om and also rk summon and the yogas i am the goal supporter the lord the witness the board the refuge and the friend i am the seat of origin and dissolution the base of preservation and the imperishable seed i give heat i hold back and send forth the rain i am immortality as well as death o arjun i am the being as also the non being thank you so much for listening everyone stay tuned we are going to finish this adhyay in the next episode